here. <laughs> Hey Rosie. <laughs> I actually streamed. I told you I would stream today and I actually did one. Oh wow, another stream. <laughs> it's not. <laughs> yeah, I actually kept my promise. <laughs> hey Mayhem. Hey Flo. <laughs> Hey Harley, hey Angel. Has it been a month already? <laughs> yeah, it's been a month. No, it's been two months. Oh, who did I play? I was supposed to play some. I didn't play Poland, I didn't play Mad Eyes. They're going Doctor, so I won't play Mad Eyes. But I can do Poland first. My bad. Yeah, I do keep saying false stuff. Man. Am I okay? Do I have a fever? <laughs> No, like, I actually was not going to stream today, I won't lie, but Wynn was like, you made a promise, so. I have to keep it. <laughs> My polling is pretty bad. Where's that announcement? What do you mean, Liv? You're the one supposed to be making the announcement. I'll play Mad Eyes if they don't go Doctor. Um, no, up left, Peepers is not, like, this is better. Left, right, Blink is better. Because when you're facing good teams, you can't only depend on... You can't only depend on the traps. You need to, like, have blink to make sure that you get the kill. Um, but when you only have the traps, you can't actually get kited if they're good. So usually left, right, and blink's better. And just give up the pallet breaking. Oh, my. No. No. No! Hey, Namesh. What's the best survivor for beginners? Perfumer. I always think Perfumer is the best survivor. She's the best kiter to, to start out and, like, just get a good feel of the game. Perfumer. Seer is pretty good, too. Because Seer teaches you to look behind you, which is really important. No, I'm so... Oh, I hate Poland so much. Hey, Val. Alien, do you watch IVL? Yeah, I watch uh, every single match of IVL. Usually twice. <laughs> but yeah, I watch a lot of IVL.
posting an announcement is too much work. Hates Poland also has a C badge. No, 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 that's deceiving. My Poland. Okay, last season it was when I got this account. I did not rank this account. Oh, of course, there's one cipher remaining. I did not rank this account. Right? I only played a little bit. So the only times I played, I was playing at like a super low tier, right? Like Cyclops or something, like a super low tier. And obviously, I'm going to have a 100% win rate because I'm playing at that tier. But no, I actually lost like half of my polling games somehow. Like against against that tier. I actually was losing because my Poland... I tried to get good with Poland, but every time I tried it, I just, like, lost every game. And then I just gave up. AFO should see my traps. AFO always wants me to play Poland just so that he could laugh at it. Mm, of course, Great Keeper is going to do that. Ah, why am I lagging? Oh, it's raining. Oh, come on. It's raining hard outside right now. Please don't pop. You popped! <laughs> oh. Is this prisoner smart enough to stun me when I get out? Let's see. No. The world is definitely going to end two days of Ireland Street. No, I wasn't trying to trap the game, the Gravekeeper. I was just trying to slow him down to make sure that he saved after half. So then, hopefully, the Cypher would be like 90 and then I could, you know, get a win. Okay, do that, and then... Ah, oh, why is Doctor so fast? I hate facing prisoners. Come back, come back in time. Take the tie. <laughs> I'll take the tie. Wait, 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 
deserve this. Oh, I was actually gonna let him go. Because <laughs> I don't even deserve the win. I was gonna let him go. <laughs> or is that just the funniest match ever? <laughs> My Poland matches are always so comical. Hey, win. Yeah, I actually did stream. <laughs> My Poland is just too good. I'm a C badge Poland. <laughs> I had this one Poland match on Red Church, right? Oh my goodness! I got so after the cipher pop, right? There's people, three people on pop. She, the dancer, already used exit path, right? Or it's a mind's eye sign. They used exit path, and then I chair. Thanks so much for the donation, Rachel. And then I chair the, um, Winter Moon. I'm not playing Mad Eyes, I'm sorry. Uh, I may play Gamekeeper. Oh, but I chair the, the prospect or whatever, the guy who's there, like, he has, like, a half a chair, right? But, like, so, one person's in Graveyard, basically bleeding out because they reuse Exit Path. And then I chair someone at Shack. And then there's the first officer that's in the middle of the map. So, I chair, and then obviously I have to make sure, like, I have peepers. The officer does not go to the, um, I should play, uh, do, do, do. no, actually, I want to play Wu-Chang, I want to play Wu-Chang. Um, yeah, two streams in a row, I know, right, Luna? So, the officer, I have to make sure he doesn't go heal up the mind's eye, of course, right? And then they can tie. He doesn't. So, the mind's eye literally is bleeding out, right? She already used her exit path at Great Girl. I chased the first officer literally throughout the duration of the this team comp is so toxic for thing. What in the world? I chased the I don't have any go Wu Chang skins in this account actually though. I'll just use Broken Blossom. Um throughout the, the duration of all of her like bleeding out you know how long to bleed out is right so but i i don't really care because i know she's gonna bleed out so i'm at least gonna win he kites me so long that i i see like i think she's gonna bleed out and then i just see that the mind's eye crawled she has no sticker by the way she crawled from graveyard all the way to the exit gate in reception and she left the gate because he opened it before and then he almost kited me to the dungeon too against my Poland but then I killed him at the last second and so I got the three man and then he was like and then he said and then he said GG easy kite <laughs> and then I just went still beat though because <laughs> my Poland is just so bad it's funny yeah I was streaming it for um for a win and mayhem at the time. And they're just making fun of my boy. This is so funny because the officer kited me li literally five minutes. <laughs> but I just win because of the, the red nose. <laughs> Can I teleport to... Oh. Okay. He went the other way. Mm. Mm. Playing at this tier is so unfun, unless I'm streaming.
My Wu Chang is back. I'm AFO 2.0. I forgot they nerfed the max bread. It's raining so hard outside. It literally rains every day where I live. It's kind of annoying. I don't even care anymore. I'm just trying to do like a fun, a fun like, um, umbrella on top of someone. Hey, Mary. Thank you. Yeah, this is definitely top tier Wu Chang gameplay. <laughs> oh, they surrendered, okay. <sighs> wow, that was intense. Am I going to do a survivor stream? Yeah, I can do. I probably will because I'm trying to hit tight in this season.
Alien ASMR win? Uh, never. I did that like one time and never ever again. That was Koa 5. Yeah, that was so good. It's ascended past Koa 4. It's Koa 5. <laughs> <laughs> and sneezed and then he won. <laughs> oh, it's Red Church. And they're actually not going anti Mad Eyes. Oh, shoot, I never made the Mad Eyes build, though. Wait, wait, wait. Oh, I don't even have a build for him, though. I don't even remember what you're supposed to bring. I literally don't remember what you're supposed to bring on Mad Eyes. Me, Max Hunt. Me, Palette Breaking. Me, Berserker, I think. You need Hunter's Instinct. These builds are all bad. Uh, I forgot what you're supposed to rain. Wait, it's a priest. That This does not look correct, but I guess. I guess. Insolence? No, not on the not on the chase mad eyes. I'm not gonna bring insolence on chase mad eyes. Because like I have to actually to do that, I have to actually be able to trap people mid tight, and I'm not good enough to do that. So my whole strategy is just going to be to find the mechanic and then kill her. Where the priest is. Definitely the priest is. No! Maybe not the priestess. Okay, the priestess. Oh, this chair is really good for Mad Eyes, but I don't know if I remember how to do it. Okay, first Mad Eyes. <laughs> um, that's C bat, C badge Mad Eyes to you. I actually lost my C badge though. That's actually really sad. My biggest accomplishment, won't even lie, was getting a B badge. Like everyone can get the C badge, fine. That takes like five points, but getting a B badge takes like two hundred points. And that means you have to actually win a match with him, which is 
insanely difficult. She didn't fall for it. Maybe I should mean mad eyes again. You know? Make the dabs nerf him for like the 20th time. Koa 5. <laughs> you know, Mad Eyes has a 100% win rate in Koa, so maybe I will do that. not drop powers. <laughs> mm, he took took out the wall. There should be like a buff. I honestly think like at max presence, he should be able to give any console, right? Plus, like, a hundred duration, in my opinion. Yeah, I'm respecting Palace, because when you get stunned as Mad Eyes, it feels like forever. Bash Mad Eyes. The funniest part is you guys probably won't remember this, but this is like a super deep cut. But this mercenary, I am very sure, I'm actually really sure. On one of my other streams that I play Mad Eyes, like, when I was just for the first time, um, when I was just, like, playing him, you know, like, oh, you get to pick. He was also, like, on that team. And I was playing Mad Eyes. I'm very sure, but I remember it. 
So that's actually funny. Strike on my mad eyes again. Mad eyes is too OP. Yeah, I'm gonna make a tier list for master. Uh, yeah, I can play Grace. Grace is actually getting a buff, which is good. Because she's not bad, but she's not great either, so... I'm happy that they're buffing her. How did I learn to use them? Um, I just watched a bunch of uh, gameplay. Like, I watched LZX a lot, which is like one of the best Mad Eyes in the world. He plays PC China, so I just watched him like all the time. Because I actually wanted to play Mad Eyes. It wasn't even a joke. I actually wanted to learn Mad Eyes. But then I like, I stopped learning him, but I still remember what. You know, I learned. Oh, oh, not the age question. No, it's only my second day back. Oh, no. Uh, they haven't announced what they're buffing of Grace. They just said they are going to buff her. <laughs> yeah, I did hear that Conan is coming to Global. I was so happy. I'm so happy. Conan is like one of my favorite anime ever. I'm so happy. I'm going to get every single skin in both essences. I don't even care. However much it takes. I'm getting it. I love all the skins too. Yes. Um, who should I play? Uh, actually, Sculptor didn't get banned, so let me play Sculptor this game. Oh, not the age question. No. <laughs> no, no, no. It started again. <laughs> <gasps> yeah, they've been in and it's too broken. Two days in a row, yep. Yeah, I want to see uh, Galateo's visit. He got stuck, or uh, if he didn't get stuck, the statue would have hit him, but he got stuck, so I actually helped him out. Oh yeah, I forgot to warn you guys, but anytime I chisel, it's going to be very, very, very loud. But it's good. It's like, it's realistic because right now, you guys don't hear it, but it's raining so loud where I am. So now you guys get to hear it too. So it's super realistic. Three, two, one. Because, like, my volume, my game volume is low, right? Um, but the game is glitched to where the chisel, how everything else is low volume, the chisel actually isn't low volume. Like, they don't, it's just glitched. They haven't fixed it. That's been a bug ever since she came out, to where the chisel doesn't, um, correlate with the in-game volume.
And you said you wouldn't do ASMR. <laughs> Caleb Teo is doing the ASMR. The same thing happened to the Enchantress. To where I put this statue at the right spot, but they get stuck on those, like, over here. So then it actually doesn't hit them. Yeah, slow pallet breaking. I only have, uh... Detention. Three, two, one. GG. Where's the... I forgot where the mark is. Oh. I don't know, um... I don't really know Lakeside Dungeons. To be honest. So... If it's not here, I literally don't know. Mm. Oh, oh, yeah, I forgot they, they nerfed the art. I thought I chiseled right here. Did I not? Am I just blind? Am I just blind? Yeah, I don't know Lakeside Dungeons like that. Huh? I only know, like, I know Arms Dungeons and no Church Dungeons. Uh, I have no idea about Leo's Dungeons. I kind of know Lakeside Dungeons. I kind of know Moonlit. Uh, I know Ever Sleeping. Like, it, because there's, the maps are only three dungeons, those are easy. So, yeah, I know those, but anyone with five, I don't. Yeah, it's too much. GG. Costume tier list. Um, well, I think, yeah, that'd be interesting, actually. Do you think they're overbuffing female dancer? Um, yeah. I don't think they should give her the twirl. Like, she should only be able to pick up the boxes. Who do I play this game? <laughs> China I have zero idea at all. This time they've been bloody clean.
Yeah, I'll play uh, Spider. I wish they buffed Spider. I wish they gave her her, her web shot from um, the start of the game, in my opinion. She should have the web shot at the start of the game. Mercenary. Yeah, it's so satisfying spinning as spider. I miss old spider. You guys don't know, but old spider, you could actually put three webs right there. And you could actually get a hit. Like, it was a guaranteed hit. If you put three webs and ruins right there, she countered ruins. It would be a guaranteed hit. But nowadays, you just can't do that. Like, I only got that hit because my quenching came up. So, like, I could see him through the wall. And that, you know, his reaction time was a little bit slow. But... Old Spider, you could just do that. I miss her. But they nerfed her till she was dead. Like they do every single hunter. Come on! Um, at least I can stop the next rescue because look at my presence. If I get one web shot, I can double web and stuff it. Yeah, I am excited for Call of 5 Spider skin. As long as it's better than that hideous Gamekeeper skin that was Call of 4. He can't even get Terra Shocked. Why didn't he just save? All he had to do was rescue because he can't even get Terra Shocked. This is why I bring Giant Claw and Spider. Come on. I could take her to the chair, but I'd rather just play for like a dungeon play. I mean a basement, a basement play. Pop it. 
Then she should get slowed, and let's see if I have enough speed. <laughs> that scared me so bad. I just saw the lawyer come and pound and stuff. <laughs> GG. IDV, I guess. <laughs> Griffin lawyer comes in. Why is it? Why is the Merc's name like that? <laughs> um, who do I play now? Well, let's see the map. No, this isn't a fancy hunter. I prefer these skins. I want a checkmate in white truffle so badly. So I had to, so I changed the counts to this one so that I could have checkmate again. And white truffle, and lady 13, and judge, and croto, and yeah, and other skins that I wanted. If they don't ban bloody queen, yeah, I guess I'll play bloody queen. This account just also has a lot of skins, so that's why you probably didn't know this. <laughs> Gamekeeper? No, I changed my mind. I actually do like Crota now. <laughs> and you want me to play Anne? Yeah, because the Animal Tamer is ugly. new accessories so badly yeah i love the accessories i love that gives the halo on them when you carry them that's so good animal tamer is not good my served here i'm like a griffin two i think right now i hit champion last season with this season i just i every time i four man teamed I got, we just lost every game.
basement. Do I like Madame Coral? Yeah, I think Madame Coral, Coral is a good skin. I don't think it's like the best skin, but I think it gets too much hate. It's a pretty good skin. Yeah, I still have Soul Catcher on this account, so I'm fine. The only server skins I really care about is Soul Catcher, Fate, and Sophia. Those are my three favorite server skins. Uh, I still have all of them, so. The best S tier skin, in my opinion, is Sophia. Like, like a little tiny, tiny, tiny bit better than Soul Catcher. Sophia, a tiny bit better than Soul Catcher, and then so then Sophia, then Soul Catcher. Those are two best, and that's not even debatable. But it has to be one or the other. Anything else is just not acceptable. Yeah, a gardener coming in with the bubble. Why do I face so many prisoners? And there's only one. There's always just one cipher remaining because we I just face so many prisoners. Of course, the forest stuns me. Hey, Numer. Golden Ratio is very good, too. I have Golden Ratio on this account, too. Oh, yeah, that's another reason. Yeah, I didn't have Golden Ratio on my other account. Um, and I really like this guy. I think this skin's so good. I love Painter. I think Painter's a really fun character. And a really underrated. I think Painter is the most underrated survivor in the game. So... Yeah, I have a golden ratio on this account, and I love it. <laughs> if only I had announcement. Oh, never mind. There he is. No, it's not about fans. That's not what matters. I don't... I don't look at it from fans. That's like saying, um... That's like saying Gardner's... That's like saying Gardner's overrated or something. But like, because Gardner has a bunch of fans. Just because people play Gardner, everyone knows Gardner's not good. So, it, that's not... It doesn't matter about fans. It's about how much they're used in competitive, their usage rate. And that's what, what I'm talking about, underrated. And goes a lot of bad, you know, there's so many doctor mains, there's so many gardener mains. It doesn't make them like overrated or underrated because they still don't get used at all in competitive. So technically, like, if gardener, you know, didn't get used, because if gardener, gardener gets used a bit in competitive, but I'm just saying, like, if she didn't, then you could still say, oh yeah, she's underrated because no one uses her. It's like how Prisoner was before his latest buff. No one ever used Prisoner in competitive. Um, no one ever used Prisoner in competitive. And I always thought Prisoner was underrated because he's good. But obviously Prisoner has so many fans. You know, in mid-tiers, everyone uses Prisoner, like you're saying right now. But he was still underrated because in top tiers, no one used him. So Painter's the same way. In top tiers, you don't really see... A lot of painters or in competitors, you don't see a lot of painters. Uh, narcissist skin? That skin is so ugly. I'm sorry. The color scheme on narcissist is so ugly. Yeah, prisoner was good before the buff. Yes, he was. 
he just was underrated. The connection was, he's just better now, of course, but he was pretty uh, good before the buff, too. The buff just made him more, all the buffs do, when IDV buff survivors, they don't, unless, okay, I'm not going to say that, because with Into and Dancer, they just make them broken, but most of the time, let me play Grace this game. Most of the time that they buff survivors, it, it actually doesn't make them broken. It just makes them, you know, more usable. That's all they did to, like, Prisoner, Postman, stuff like that. Like, you know, uh, Prisoner's fault was that if he gets found early game before he can touch a cypher, then he has no cutting. So all they did was just give him a stun at the start of the game. I'm going to play Grease this one. But, like, obviously that one-second stun doesn't make him broken. Like, Postman's pretty underrated, too. And Postman has a bunch of things, but... I remember back when no one used to use Postman, and he was, like, such a dead, dead character. Um, but I always had so much fun playing Postman because he's the most, like, support character in the game. But he was not good at all. But he was fun. Please. Aw, oh, he rotated out of the shack. He's smart. Cowboy against Grace is just torture. Because, like, the thing that kills Grace is transitional kiting. And that's exactly what Cowboy does. So it's just so awful, dude. Jeez, I'm not even going to chase him. No, I didn't mean to bring it back. I clicked the wrong button. I meant to dash. What is your opinion of who's better than uh, Nyad or BQ? Right now, BQ is better than Nyad. Um, BQ is actually pretty strong in the meta right now. Because most of the meta characters that people use, Prisoner, and Postman, Entomologist, you know, just those types of characters, they don't counter, like BQ counters them. So she's actually pretty decent. Yeah, I'm sorry, but Narcissus is just so ugly. The color scheme for me is so, so bad. I just... I... That's one of the only skins that when I look... Like, when I look at it, it actually hurts me to watch. Like, it really hurts me to just look at that skin. Because of the color scheme. Yeah, Postman's like kind of meta. And you also see a lot less perfumers now, of course, than you used to. You only see perfumer because she's good against um, Poland and she's good against. And she's good against uh, Bloody Queen, but you don't see her so much because she's not good against Sculptor and Bomb Bon and Dreamwork. So you also see less perfumers. And she's bad, she's terrible against Anne, too. So that helps Bloody Queen out. You see less explorers nowadays. Less people play explorer. That helps Bloody Queen out because explorer is hard counters Bloody Queen. So it's just a combination of seeing less explorers and perfumers and seeing more, you know, prisoners in toes.
which makes her a much stronger character. Divine is uh, Divine isn't good. I think black form of Divine is not bad. I think white form of Divine is pretty ugly. Skin in the game is here warning clothes. That's a pretty good one. Oh, I forgot there's a cowboy. I was looking at chat and I forgot there's a cowboy on the team. I'm so done. I was looking at chat. Embrace is a good skin. It's just, yeah, it's a pretty, just good skin overall. It's not an amazing skin, but it's good. True Proof is a very, very good skin. True Proof is a really good skin. A barmaid's a really good character. Demi Supremacy. I remember when I said barmaid was like, a plus tier or something and you know a bunch of people got mad and then a certain other you know youtuber got mad that I put on an A plus tier but I don't care because she's good Oops, I messed up. <laughs> you got <laughs> Firefly is a good skin. Firefly is a good skin. It's not great. It's a good skin. I like the idea a lot of her like being, you know, a, a singer. Like I really like it. It's just the actual implementation is okay. It's not bad, but I like the accessory a lot that she sings when she gets, um, when she's healing up. Pawnbroker is a good Axe Boy skin. It's just a really solid skin. It's my favorite survivor. Um, mm, that's hard. My favorite survivor used to be Acrobat, Dancer. Nowadays... How did that... Okay. Uh, yeah, Checkmate's a really good skin. Nowadays, my favorite serve is... I like Prospector a lot. I like Into a lot. I liked Into before the buff. I love Into's, like, whole design and character. So once she gets nerfed, it will be Into. But right now... Is, I can't say it's Into because she's broken. So, it's like, you know, saying Priest is your, is your favorite survivor. But once she gets nerfed next week, then I'll be able to say it's Into. So, for right now, I'll just say um, Prospector. I also like Enchantress a lot. I want to be an Enchantress main. Exorcist is a good skin. It's overrated, though. Good skin, but overrated. Shining Feather is a good skin. Yeah, that Enchantress's early game is just so rough. She can just die really quick. I honestly think Enchantress should start with one stun at the start of the game. Like, Prisoner starts with a stun, she should start with a stun, too.
What Galatea S tier girl I like better? I like her new one better. Checkmate is a really good skin, though. It's a really good skin, but I do think her new one is just a better design than Checkmate. Uh, I may show the DM skin. Yeah, I may. I didn't buy the package, but my friend. So, maybe. I don't like the skin, though. I'm sorry. I don't like it. DM skin is... Do you think Joseph is good for easy wins? Yeah, low tiers he is. Low to mid tiers, he's really easy. He's good for easy wins. Um, Violinist is, just, is a solid hunter. He's not... Great, he's kind of usable, you know. Solid hunter. Hey, a catchy. The new chain skin. Oh, the new chain skin is good. I could play Gamekeeper since it's Moonlit. New chain skin is good, but the accessory is really the best part. Thanks so much, Lucy. I hope you're having a great day, too. Do you, I have a favorite NBA team? Yeah, I like the Clippers. Uh, don't ask why. I just, I just always like them. I always liked them uh, back when they had, like, Chris Paul and Blake Griffin. Uh, Grace Academy? That wouldn't be bad. Once Grace... I was gonna go for first Grace, but then I gave up, so... Maybe if she gets, like, buffed. I could play Percy. March hair is bad. March hair is bad. March hair is bad, 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 bad. I don't have any good game... Uh, yeah, Gamekeeper skins. But it's moonlit. I can't believe. This build is definitely not it. This build is not it. Uh, no, I don't have his Koa skin. And if I did have his Koa skin, I would never use it in my life. Never ever use that skin in my life. Archer is bad. So bad. Um... Okay, I guess the person who spawned there just went to double story instead of point. The new clown, the logic fat skin is bad. It would be nice. I would. Where's the mines? Percy is trash. Yeah, he's trash. Um, wait, I lost the mind's eye. I was looking at chat. I lost the mind's eye. The, all the Conan skins are great. I think the Conan is the best crossover they've ever done. Flashbacks to PP Ja playing Gamekeeper in Koa and actually Tong. Mr. Swift is a really good skin. Persona 5, uh, that crossover is good, but the difference is all of the Persona 5 skins did not hit. Like, 
Mm-hmm. The regular embalmer skin is so ugly. The forward skins are just bad. So Persona 5 is very good, but... Oh, I'm throwing, but not all of those skins look great. Well, every single Conan skin is great. Come on! <gasps> I just... <laughs> No comment. I really miss teleporting. I don't have detention on this dumb build. I forgot. I forgot. I don't have detention on this build. I'm so done. Oh my. <laughs> <laughs> what? <laughs> this bee skin is actually really good though. I'm getting on my mind's eye. Oh. Gamekeeper. I forgot. Back when I used to do these streams, like when I used the stream so long ago, I used to literally do whatever I wanted, like this game. And I would still tie. Like, I, the ciphers just would not be done. But nowadays, if I do that, <laughs> the ciphers are already primed. Like, the mid-tiers are evolving. Uh, Viper is a good skin. Yeah, Viper is a uh, really good skin. Viper is the only... Huh? Viper is the best prisoner skin, I would say that. Because Viper prisoner does not have good skins overall his two crossover skins are literally just the um the same skin the both crossover skins are just the same thing his other a tier is okay i guess so he needs better skins viper isn't the best sir skin by any means but for prisoner it's good i'm gonna play geisha They aren't evolving, the game is just devolving. <laughs> they aren't evolving. Yeah, I mean, that's kind of true too, but. Cypher is so much faster now. I don't need uh, a profile. Lady 13, yeah. 
I can finally live out my geisha main dreams with Lady 13. This dream was not met anymore. Uh, I mean, the tears are just worker bees, but we're bad. <laughs> yeah, when you when you're playing serve, they are. Um, dream witch is still meta. She's just not as broken as she used to be, but she's still S tier. S minus tier, I should say. <coughs> she yeah, she's harder to play. Geisha is so satisfying to play. Uh, Junko, Demi's Junko skin. That's a good skin. I like it. Oh! <laughs> okay, Geisha is not satisfying to play when you get Palette Stunned. Yes, I do remember when I lost my 100% win rate because of Geisha. I'll never forget that. That's actually one of the most traumatizing moments in my IDV, you know, ever, my career. Was Leo's memory Geisha 100% win rate, and I lost it because of her. Picture Woman is very ugly. It's ugly and it's unplayable because it literally covers up the screen. Oops. This looks like a tie. I'm just getting cypher us. <laughs> it's just gonna be a tie. Someone, yeah, they're, and they're gonna shoot a gunshot. There's nothing I can even do. I literally. <laughs> I dashed. She was gonna hit the chair. She was gonna hit the chair, and I dashed into the. Into the gunshot. That was awful. Am I actually gonna lose? Wait, 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 wait. Don't pop, don't pop, don't pop, don't pop, don't pop, don't pop. Do not, 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 do not. Please. <gasps> Yeah, it's Larry Prime. It was Prime. Because. Can you take the butterfly? Okay. Did it work? It actually worked. Oh, no, my no, other cypher's done. Okay, yay. I love this game. Oh, no, they popped that one. They popped that one. Okay. I got a portal trick. <laughs> That's the merc. No thanks. And my um, 
teleport, it won't be that. Yeah, it's a top. Oh. I have to actually stop playing Dumb Hunters. These serves not a decode now. These serves actually not a decode. I say I should stop playing Dumb Hunters, but I really want to play Ripper, so... <laughs> That's kind of a thing. Uh, I play Soul Weaver early. Yes, they say Geisha's not under... Yeah, Geisha's underrated if you're actually good with Geisha. Good vacation. Me, I'm not. Geisha, I hate. <laughs> BQ Hunter can be. I may. BQ. Okay. Yeah, I watched IVC. Yeah, I saw that. I think it was Hospital, right? Where the Geisha got a 4K with uh, Geisha in the Japan IVC. Yeah. If you're good with Geisha, then she's strong. Yeah, I should use Percy. Bye-bye, Emma. Percy sucks, though, so... Oops. It's okay. <laughs> I literally almost threw, but I mean, it's okay. They insta save. I don't see why ban. No, that's not an actual legacy player. Well, you're going to steal one of the um, most fun hunters in the game. Yeah, that's my favorite part about the skin too, is how it looks like a butter knife for her weapon. It's so, I love that. I also love, um, oh, they, okay. I also love right here, you like this metal, like, it's like a metal cage right there. I just love that part so much. I don't even know why. But that's this skin is just so, 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 so good. It's so, so good. Boy Queen is still, like, one of the most fun hunters. I'm actually fine that she got nerfed now because, um... She didn't need to be nerfed, but 
she's good again with the meta, so I'll take it. And I, a lot of times at IVL, even though she's Thai Queen, she actually wins a lot of games. To be honest, I think she's probably won the most games of any hunter in IVL. Because if Sirs make, if you're a really good Bloody Queen, and Sirs make one mistake, and you don't miss your mirrors, then you can actually win. But if you miss mirrors, it's like, miss one to two mirrors, it's a tie. Miss anything more than two mirrors, and it's a loss. What would you say is the best hunter skin? Um, the best hunter skin? That's actually hard. That's actually difficult. Like, mm. I like Bloodbath a lot. That's definitely... Bloodbath may be the best hunter skin. Grace's, Grace's skin is already one of the best. So Bloodbath, Grace's S skin. Those are really good. I don't see why Lily. No, that's not anyone on Legacy. Yeah, I have Vajet. Vajet is my personal favorite skin because of the follower. And I have that on this account. Positioning Blade Queen's mirrors, you have to be really... It mainly takes practice is the biggest thing. It just takes practice. Like, your depth perception will improve the more you play Bloody Queen. So, when you first play her, she's a hunter that just takes playing a lot. Because when you first play her, your depth perception will just be terrible. Like, you won't be able to hit any mirrors. You'll just have to teleport. But as you play her more and more and more and more and more, your depth perception gets better and better and better until it just becomes really good and then you have to be really patient with the mirror so when you put it you have to like you can't waste the mirror you have to put it at the perfect time and just be patient with your hits <laughs> i alien hitting blanks is just really him i take three months off and suddenly i can't hit blanks Yeah, Dream, I think, quit the game, too. She doesn't play. Who's in the main team? Uh, it's me. People still on Legacy. It's me, AFO, Pilly, Daku, Miri, V, Green, and Alex. And those are all the players. And then Mayhem and Wind, or, of course, Mayhem's the coach. Wind's the manager. Um... Daku, Pilly, me, AFO are the are hunters, and then Miri, Fungi, Green, Alex are all survivors. What? One time, AFO missed a blink and he said, Ew, I alien blink. <laughs> Is there going to be a summer training? I believe so. Either summer or fall. I do believe there will be a tourney.
Do I not have the? I do have the S accessory for Bloody Queen. I do have it. But I actually think this one looks better. Like, with the skin, I kind of think this looks better because it changes the mirror. It makes it, like, purple and stuff. And I actually like Bloody Queen's regular pickup. I remember when I did this in Attorney. And I terror shocked them. <laughs> what? What? No, 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 no. That timing. That timing. I'm I'm done. How are you handle this can be a uh, uh, I Arcana. Oh Arcana so the team it's it's called Vendetta now. Arcana's called Vendetta. But yeah, I still coach them and we still play tournaments. It's just called Arcana became Vendetta. Um Okay. Wow. So I was going to say I played a tournament one time with Bloody Queen. And I did that trick, and I terror shocked like the first officer going for the save, and it literally won me the game. And I just did it again. <laughs> I, I, the timing of that is so is so insane. I can't even. Okay. <laughs> That is like one of the best moments. Like, you ever watch those um compilations where it's like streamers like perfect timing compilations? Like, there's like one of those moments. <laughs> mm, I kind of don't really care anymore. Um, and then Intel because Intel's broken. <laughs> Top 10 Ionian moments. <laughs> or they just made a compilation of like top 10 Ionian stream moments. That should be really funny. I wonder what would be number one. I love you too, Nina. I wonder what would be number one. Would it be, I think, probably when um, I got, I guess when I got hit by the train as Photo and Ever Sleeping. Yeah, no scar. Yeah, I've been injured because she's broken. I guess it would be when I got hit by a train on Ever Sleeping. That'd be the number one moment. Yeah. I mean, that's a dumb moment, though. It wasn't a good moment. It's a bad moment. But I guess that would have to be it. Um... Stop, it would not be giving my opinion. No, that's that's awful. The Bloody Queen moment's pretty high up there. The I, I the, the lizard the lizard stream the lizard suffer stream would be a really good moment. If you guys remember on Leo's memory. That would be top. Dang, now I actually want to do that. Like go through all my streams and just find the top ten moments. Someone's right there. <laughs> Falling through the hole in tournament, yeah, that's top. I mean, does it count every like turning moments too, or just stream moments? That'd be the question. If it counts turning moments, yeah, it'd be. It would be falling through a hole. Why is Intel broken? She just, she's, she's broke. Yeah, like they bossed her to where, oh, you guys don't know. Basically when she, she can call the bees and she can ride the bees and then you hit them. And then three seconds later, she calls them back. You hit them. Three seconds later, she calls them back. You hit them, you know. She, that's why she's going to get nerfed. Next week. Oh, this week. Tomorrow. Oops.
I, the blink, we don't talk about that. I've been doing so good with blinks. Just for me to do that. <laughs> Yay, perfumer. I meant to go back. I knew she was going to do that. <laughs> you see, I use like blink because, you know, uh, yeah, I can't even think of a reason. Uh, well, they're just nerfing, like, the speed of the bees. They're nerfing the duration of the bees. And now when you hit the bees, it, like, it won't reset the health. Like it used to. My Vio is low-key popping off. I kind of want to main Vio again. Like, I won't even lie. Well, if I just, like, had fun, I just went for, like, top one Vio again. Uh, I think Vio is like a minus tier in the meta. He's a, he's, he's at the very edge of being com of being viable. Like he's viable in rank. He's viable in tournaments. You can use him in those, but he's like any worse, and he would not be usable. Yeah, forward and go for any rescue. My opinion on Prospector, um, Prospector is a, is a really good survivor. Prospector is pretty good, but in this server and in, like in China, he just does not get used as much as I think he should. So I think Prospector is like A plus tier survivor in my opinion. He has fast healing. He has, you know, a little bit faster decoding. He has good kiting. He starts off with kiting. He can harass. He has no debuffs at all. I think Prospector is a really good survivor if you're good with him. GG. Top 10 times and hit the chip. Uh, I need to get my charger. I need to stretch so bad. What? What? Can A dancer's buff, it's gonna make her pretty good. I think they overbuffed her, but whatever, they'll make her good. It's hospital, I don't really want to play Dreamway. Could I play Axe Boy. I could play Bon Bon. She hates my I could play Photo. I could play. Damage. 
this way. Oh, wait. Uh, okay. I guess we're playing Axe Boy. <gasps> yeah, I'm a sea badge. Nah, yeah. <laughs> I think I played her like seven games in rank or something. And I'm somehow sea badge. I'm a sea badge dream when sea badge nigh at sea badge Poland. Too good. Where's the flame? I Oh, that's the nerf. That's literally the nerf. It went out of range. It's the nerf. Mm. Candy Girl is a good mech skin. Yeah, I don't know. I just wish they didn't nerf Axe Boy. Like, he... Axe Boy was my favorite hunter. Axe Boy was my favorite hunter. He's just so fun to play. And now he's not bad. He's still a decent hunter, but he's just not as fun as he used to be. Like, I used to love just sniping people with fireballs. It's just, like, the sound... I hit the chair. Oh, um, okay. The sound of... of a fireball landing on a survivor was just the most satisfying sound in, in this game. Yeah, I hit the chair. I mean, it's been it's the second day streaming. I finally hit the chair. I wanted to see how long I could go without hitting the chair, but I broke it. Why is everyone here? Why? I did not think... No, 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 here's the thing. Okay, so I thought I could... At first, I was not going to go to the pallet. I was going to bait... I was going to bait the pallet and hit her through, right? But then I saw her get slow, and I was like, oh, it's fine. Like, there's no way she can reach me in time. And it turns out there was. Why is there one side for remaining? Why did I die? <laughs>
Oh, that didn't hit. Okay. Yeah, I literally can only hit blind fireballs. I don't even know what it is. Like, if I can actually see the serve, it, it messes me up in a way. Oh, I finished my promo. This story is so fun. I wish I could play it more. GG. GG. That one gamekeeper lost. <laughs> that one gamekeeper lost. Don't be dead for the next month. Hey, I promised you guys I was going to stream today. Sir's about to say alien cheated while he's using X Boy again. <laughs> uh, no comment. Just go for top. What is top one X Boy? Who even plays X Boy anymore? Hey, I seven K. Let's. How does that compare to someone else? Like, sculptor gets banned. That's a bad comparison. Ninety three hundred. 75. Oh, 7K is easy then. Yeah, 7K is actually not bad. Uh, so maybe I could go for it. Um, so yeah, I promised you guys I was gonna stream today. And I did, so... I'm not going to promise I'm going to stream tomorrow, but I should, I am probably going to stream tomorrow. Uh, but yeah, I'll definitely keep streaming more this week, but I think I'll stream tomorrow. I'll most likely stream tomorrow. So I'll see all of you guys tomorrow. Thanks everyone for coming to watch the stream. I hope you all have a great day, and I'll see you guys tomorrow. Bye-bye. Tomorrow is code for next year. Bye-bye. Uh,